Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time with me, Rock Paper Mario, and she's going to say something I do not want her to say right now. They're not that bad, they're just kind of... they just creep you out. It's like, like the actual enemies themselves are not actually even that threatening. It's just the even the thought of them is the threatening part. Do you know? That's the thing with them. The wall masters or whatever. Hi there. A nice painting of a ghost. Has Egad been here or something like that? We're making somewhat okay progress. I'm 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 satisfied with how we've been doing. Okay, well this is that room now. Okay, come on. I just like threw that into the hole. And there's the phone. Okay, I'm back, and like, I'm just making a mess of this, okay? Like, first of all, I threw that thing in the hole. Okay, there, that's better. Come on, get off that stupid hole of yours. Come on. Don't fall into the hole, Link. Now, the t this is pretty cool, I love how, like, and once that hole has gone out of the way, I don't mind, but I love how, like, that comes down, and then, like, the other two, like, come up. It's just, like, it's really cool. I don't even care about taking the damage. I've got mill. Like, my timing on that was completely screwed up. Ooh, slow down. That was more like it. Come on. Come on. Gotcha there. And I got you there as well, man, like, Deku Nuts for the win, seriously. That, like, phone call, that was a survey, that's what it was. I'm pretty sure the last time I, like, got a survey, um, like, someone calling for a survey was during, like, when I was fighting the Elite Four in, okay, where am I? I wish I had, see, it's the times like these where I wish I had the compass. I have no idea what way I came into this room now. They probably showed me and I just didn't take any notice. I was like an idiot. But yeah, like, it was a survey. I'm pretty sure the last time I got, like, a, someone ringing about a survey while I was recording was when, like, I, um, was doing the Elite Four and Pokemon Yellow. Oh, no, like, that was the Red Ghost, wasn't it? That, like, we might as well do that now, I suppose. That was like the red ghost that was in the room where we were just in, but we might as well do that now. We've got the arrows. I'm so happy to have the arrows. But still, like, I think... I'm pretty sure this is, like, the same. Just remember to only press it once. Okay, so where are you? She's not up there, so she must be like... Yeah, there you are. Yeah, that's the red one. So this is like, the way we came. This is like, just remember to only press it once so you don't end up like, wasting an arrow if you have to go back out of it again. This is so like, um, like Luigi's Mansion. And I feel like I never noticed that until now, but I must have, because it is really like Luigi's Mansion. If I could be a, if I could learn to twang like a rubber band, I'd be a rubber band. Wait a second, I thought like Deku nuts worked on you. Oh yeah, they do. Oh yeah, they bring you out of like your invisible status. Excuse me. But they like. Yeah, that's it. Like, I knew, like, I had, like, a way of, like, killing them with, like, the sword really quickly because you, you just, like, use a Deku Nut on them when they're invisible and then you can just, like, stab them. We'll do this one more time. And then you can, like, jump slash them. But, like, I've wasted all my Deku Nuts. I'm desperately in need of some. But that's okay. Like, those piranha plants are really good for dropping them. Please be the compass. This, like, place is too confusing for me not to have the compass, and I'm pretty sure that's not the compass because it's too small. Yeah, like, that's what, I, that's what, that's a key. Okay, well, fat lot of good, that's gonna do me. <laughs> Maybe did one of these pots will drop Deku Nuts. I love my Deku Nuts, I really do. I, they're just so useful. 
And I feel like they're really underused or something. It's like people don't you don't like give them the credit they're due. Especially when you're fighting Stalfos and things like that. And fighting them you can like get them with jump slashes and stuff like that when when they're being invisible. No, I want like No, I want Deku nuts. Well, thanks a million. Well, I suppose I can use the arrows. It's just like those fights against them take so long. You did what I told you not to do, you dingus. I said press it once, don't press it. There she was, right there. I feel like I end up doing this like in the same order every time. Like, I feel like I end up doing it, like, up and then the one on, like, the opposite wall and then the one, like, on the landing, like, every single time I do this. Those paintings are so like the paintings in Luigi's Mansion. They look like, really like them. But yeah, oh well. Looks like we'll... Now turn invisible. No, come on, I did it, like, wrong. I keep forgetting, like, you don't have to re-bring like bring out the sword. Oh, well, now I don't have any. Come on. Come on. There we go. It's like, if you, like, I wouldn't have wasted uh, half as many Deku Nuts on that other thing if I'd remembered, like, to jump slash them. That's the compass, thank you. Just what I needed. But yeah, was a... <gasps> Wait a second, that was Deku... No, it wasn't. That was something else. I thought I saw Deku nuts there and I got all excited. Way more excited than I am about the contents of this treasure chest. Yay, the compass! That's what I was... And that's like the thing that I actually was looking for. I was like, oh, I want the compass, please. So that I should act could actually like try and find my way around this place. Those, those like two skull tullers that I haven't got it are bothering me as well because I can't like remember I remember like where they are kind of but I can't like yeah I know Navi I know I know I don't think we can actually do anything in here can we was this like a mistake yes this was a mistake I'm pretty sure this was a big mistake get out of there Where's my hook shot? <laughs> I think someone's a little cranky. I'm like, where's my hook shot? It's like, where's my chocolate milk? Would you hit him? It's like, it's just the easiest way, because, like, if you don't kill them, like, in one go, they end up bouncing around the place, and then you have to try and, like, get them, like, with the hook shot again or something. It's like, and I need another key. I'm pretty sure I didn't do this. I wish I'd used Pharaoh's Wind, like, back there where you, like, turn the room around now. Grab onto that. No, you're not going to, are you? Because you're not Twilight Princess Link. You can't grab onto ladders in midair. You're just Ocarina of Time, Twink. See, this is where things get confusing. See, now, like, remember, like, we twisted that? I should have, like, just kept going in the direction I was going when I went back and, like, got the orange pole. No, nothing there. I'm pretty sure once you've got the contents once, you won't be able to, like, get them again or something. That's, like, what my, what, what, um, my instincts are telling me. Excuse me. Excuse me? I can't believe I have to jump slash a pot. Like, that's the most annoying thing about being Twink, actually, is, like, having to... Is, like, having to... Like, the, the, how difficult it is to get the pots, because, like, you, he just swings his sword and it goes, like, right over them. It's ridiculous. I'm still, like, somewhat satisfied with our progress here. Like, I'm not doing it completely badly. <laughs> I'm just doing it not as goodly as I could be doing it. I can't... Like, isn't the boss key in one of those rooms? Either that one or the other one that's all, like, twisty-turny? I can't remember. There's... See, like, there's no point in using Pharaoh's Wind now when I, like, go back. Excuse 
me come back here. Yeah, he, he was like staring me down. He was eyeballing me, that guy. That Stalfo's head. But, um... But yeah, um, it doesn't, it doesn't, it's like, it's not going to be worth it to use, isn't the boss key in here? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, there it is. Okay, and then you like drop down through the hole in the ceiling. Okay, now I have kind of have an idea of where we're going. See, it does, it, it's not worth it to use Pharaoh's Wind now, it's only worth it like there at like the start because like, Where's the hole in the where's the hole where's the hole? There was like a master hand or whatever coming. Now I don't even know where I am. See I almost like prefer to use like the hook shop because like first of all you don't end up wasting arrows and it's actually you can kill them just by hitting them with the hook shop once. And then hitting them with your sword once. It's just more efficient. It takes less time, and there's less, like, and they don't go jumping around like maniacs. See, here we are again. Now, where's my gold skull? Oh, hello, sir. Give me Deku Nuts, please. Yay, thank you! Oh my god, I love Deku Nuts. Now, where's the Skull Tulla? Because, like, I'm telling you, there are, like, Skull Tullas in each of these, like, courtyard rooms. I'm completely confused. I have no idea what, like, what, what I'm supposed to do. I'm gonna go back in here. And get locked in! Hello! Hello! Thank you, thank you, I appreciate it. Yeah, you didn't like that, did ya? Did ya? You didn't like that one bitch, you stupid little hands. It's like... <laughs> <laughs> they just like make me nervous, I swear. At least I went into the right room first. What did I get? Oh, magic jar, a bigger magic. They're just like the other ones, but bigger. Okay, well, thank you. Thanks for making me aware of that. And we got another key. Well, we're nearly like... I, we're, we're definitely halfway through. It's just that I'm going to get confused now, and those skull tullers are going to confuse me. I can tell you right now. And there I was, like, at the start of the dungeon, like, Oh, it's not actually that hard. Wait a second, isn't this just where I was? Isn't this, like, no, this is, like, that room. What happens if I hit that eye? This is just going to, like... That's arrows, or a heart, or something, I can tell you right now. What I need to do is I need to, like... I'm confused. Wait a second, let's, like, go back. No, I have to, like, go forward now. Like, I can't go back. Excuse me. See, he went flying, like, halfway across the room. That guy. Might as well go up and get that chest, I don't know what it is. Do you know what I might? And then I'll finish the video, because I'm getting confused. <laughs> this is the point, see, I told you. Like, I can start this temple no bother, and then I get to this point. Like, once you, like, twist the corridor, and I get confused. I get completely and hopelessly confused. And now, no, now I know, because now I have another key. Okay, now I know. I'm not completely confused after all. Okay, well, this is... Now, okay, yeah, well, obviously. Obvi. All you have to do is, um... I'm pretty sure that uh, that chest is just rupees. It's not a key. I know it. I know it's either rupees or a heart or arrows or something. Because it's completely not important. I remember, like, going out of my way to get it before and just being like, Oh, well, great. I feel so, um, privileged to have got that. See, way easier than using arrows, I swear. The hookshot is just like... Like, sometimes you have to use arrows. But, like, most more often than not, you can get away with just using the hookshot. So we've got to untwi- we've got to twist you up again. Got 
to make you all twisty turny, all topsy turvy again. Now that we've got the boss key, I suppose that's the important thing. We've got the boss key and we've got another key so we can go back through again, I suppose. Joe you know Watt, just in case, I'm going to use like Pharaoh's Wind here. Just in case I end up having to come back here when I'm like looking for skull tullers. But other than that, I'm gonna say, look, I'm ending off this video here again. Thanks again for watching this part of Let's Play The Legends of the Ocarina of Time. Hopefully in the next part we'll finish it, if not in the part after that. So thanks for watching and bye.